Now, a new PCR machine has been installed at the Cape Coast Metropolitan Hospital in the central region to help test and issue COVID-19 test results quickly. Director General of the Ghana Health Service, Dr. Patrick Kuma Bwaje, says this will help eliminate delays associated with the testing and issuing of test results. The PCR machine, which costs $120, is the first in the central region. Richard Kwejunyako uh, was there and has come through with this report. So we are here at the Cape Coast Metropolitan Hospital and this is the first PCR machine that has been brought here according to the Director General of the Ghana House Service. This is a step in the right direction to help test people that are affected by COVID faster and to enable them to get their results very quickly in order for certain decisions to be made. I think um, at the beginning of the COVID, we had challenges with the delay in testing with a large backlog. And so one of the efforts was to scale up and expand the access to tests. We brought in the private, we expanded as few more large public sector labs, Tamale, Bolga, with um, and other machines to ensure that we are able to test quickly and isolate. Uh, Cape Coast still remain a big challenge because uh, apart from the gene expert machine at the metro, we do not have any PCR machine that was doing that. And so when Alex offered to support us, we said that well, Metro provides the best environment, not only because you don't have, but also we, say, we have a lot of schools here, the schools reopened, we have a tourist attraction, we want to make sure that anybody who's coming here will know that should there be any problem, not only can they be treated, but they cannot be made diagnosed, and that's why we made the effort. He also threw more light on the inoculation exercise that is being conducted across the country. It's been wonderful, we've had more than 3,000 vaccinated in the very first day, uh, which is quite unusual because of the way it's done. Everything is electronically guarded and so each vaccination takes time. We should be able to get enough information to be able to track the same person for the next vaccine. And so it's not the usual vaccine that you drop in the mouth or eject and go. This has to be very elaborate and we know that globally there may be some requirement to still proof of vaccination, and so we're taking all that into consideration. The Central Regional Director of Health Services, Dr. Akusia Sapon, has been explaining the breakthrough this PCR machine would do for the people in the region in terms of the COVID-related issues. Yes, it erases that challenge, you know. Within a short time, people can get their results and then we can start managing, we can start isolating. So it is a very good thing for central region to get. Uh, we have other tests, but uh, PCR is the first in the region. So from the Cape Coast Metropolitan Hospital, my name is Richard Kwejunya for Joy News. Richard Kwejunyako there with that report. And that is how we wrap it up on the AM News this morning. Stay tuned. We bring you the news review shortly.